so it's really, really hard to see. But up on that hilltop in front of me is Dover Castle. Just about to see it in the darkness. You see a flag just swinging around up there. Well, the yeah, reason we're here right now near Dover Castle is we're going to sneak underneath it. This is going to be like a complete stealth. And it's not just that, we've got to climb the cliffs and everything. And when I say we, obviously I'm not alone. Who do you think I could have dragged out with me? Who's been missing for so long and so many questions asking me where the guy is? Come here, Luke. Let's put you on camera. All right, guys. Luke, who it is? <laughs> it's Mark. Right, guys. Hey, guys. We're back. Where are we going? To a castle. We're sitting under that castle up there, Dover Castle. We're crazy. I think no. we are. I think we are. I think we are. Wolf. We're getting serious trouble. We get cold. First. That's the fact it's so windy tonight. I know we don't probably sand it here, but we're like kind of shell. Uh, no, not shell. Sure, they have things for that, Dave. To get that under control. I don't know. You can, can't really see it out there, bro. But it's just literally up there. You see the flag swinging around. Yeah. But there is a film crew as well. So, um, you ready, bro? I'm gonna get back in the car. I'm gonna go and find somewhere to park. Let's go and do it, brother! Right, what's happening, guys? So, you already see where we're going, right? You right. I'm so glad and hopefully you are as well that I've got Mark here. <laughs> Bad time, tell him, guys. Um, Thank you, <laughs> But, to be fair, Mark, we won't go into a lot of his details, but he's had a little boy. Um, obviously, we're both fathers, and it is difficult. And obviously... And working. Yeah, and he obviously working as well. Both work all the time. Uh, but we are going to do a live as well, so if you do know us, um, we are going to go back and do a live soon. So stay put for, and look out for any bits. But yeah, guys, just a recap. We've parked up where we think's right. We're going to head through the woodlands. We're going to head pretty much up like a cliff to get under Dover Castle. Remember, this place is highly secured. We're going in the defence tunnels system under Dover Castle where I'm guessing they would have sent all the royals years ago and obviously like hired out and gun points and gun batteries we're going to hopefully see a lot and this is completely off the public tour isn't it? Yes. <laughs> and we don't even know if we're going to get in and the fact is they're actually filming in Dover Castle right now. Um, we'll probably definitely get arrested. Yeah all the film crews up there at the moment yeah for, this could this could be the end of us on YouTube I'm not even joking about it. Tiny Tim I won't be home this Christmas. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> if, if you don't see it don't see this video, then obviously you're going to see the news article anyway. Um, but yeah, I don't know how it's going to go. It's the, the weather is so bad as well. We know a few people have done this place, and all we were told is it's too rainy today. Cut, or like call it off. But yeah, I'm actually flying to Italy now. in leaving for the airport in six hours from now. So I need to get in out of here, back home, packed and done. And it's twenty to one in the morning. <sighs> right. You ready? Let's go. Alright, let's get out and let's get through these woods, up the hills, in the wellies. Let's crack on. Right, what happens on country roads? <laughs> country roads take me home to a place I belong. West Virginia, Mountain Mama, Dover Castle. Let's get arrested. <sighs> Yeah, we'll show you again up the way or back up there, but there's a whole film crew. I don't know if, well, if we're about to see them, but this road is literally pitch black. My car's all the way up there. You can't even see the car. But, yeah, we literally got to try and hunt for a way through the woods. Was it here? I mean, here, I mean, we worked out. Can't believe it's so windy. We're not climbers, we're old, nearly 40 year old men. We're not old, are we, but, you know, we're not as physically strong anymore, Mark, as much as we tell ourselves. <laughs> and we're about to climb pretty much. We've got a, down a muddy cliff. With razor wire and everything, bro. Right, we're gonna get, have to do a bit of stealth now, guys, so we're gonna come off a minute. This is the woodland bits we were talking about. Uh, we are literally, um, we're still in quite a public area, so they can't really say nothing at the moment. Um, in a minute, 
we're going to be going to parts we're going to have to keep the lights low and yeah we just don't want to get caught as I said bro you know dude I hope you got your passport on you mate because if we slip off them cliffs you know they're going to be waiting at the bottom with passport control <laughs> it'd be like the scene bro from Con Air where we're going to fall from the sky oh, don't say that mate I've got a flight in the morning Yeah, this is the way that we planned, we hope. Oh, look, let's keep the light on, look, it's light. So I've got to turn the light off, you can't, you can't even see it on this camera. Just about there, there's a little light appearing for the trees. That, believe it or not, no crap, is the film crew. They're literally filming in the grounds of Dover Castle. But we are, we're going to be below them. You're going underneath. Dude, there's probably dogs and patrol and everything on the grounds. Huh? Dude, could we be done for terrorist charges? Like, arrested on suspected terrorism. I mean... These tunnels are disused, they're not used, but... It's still under the castle, isn't it? The guys, we literally hacked all the way up through the woods. The castle's literally right up there. It's so dark. It's so hard to kind of show you how far we've got to go up. Bro, I just think it's too windy. This is where it's going to get really dodgy. Your voices. Did you hear that? I'm going to have to keep lights low. This is going to be a mission, dude. I don't know if this is the worst mission we've ever done until we've done it, but. This is definitely a risky one though, bro. Yeah. We're literally just going by the maps as well. Kind of plan the route to this place. The route in. And nothing's gonna be easy. I'm already getting hooked. Hard. That's a drop, bro, right down there. Yeah, no. So we're gonna have to go down here and around and obviously work our way out around near this fence. I can see razor wire. Oh, mate. What are we doing? Doing an update, as per usual. You ready? Yes. Let's go for it, mate. What can we do? What can we do? Nothing. What can we do? Try not to slip down here. I'll oh, be careful, man. Guys, you can hear that wind as well. There's no like artificial sands put in this. It is how it is. It's a really stormy night. You alright? Yeah. I don't even go over the fence yet, bro. Just looking at the drop. Hey? Just looking at the drop. Ah, oh, don't look at the drop. Can't believe we're even doing it, mate. Oh, here we go. Oh, shoot. Give me the fence, you don't know. Can't even grip, bro. How are you gripping? Oh my god. Oh. Well Why am I even still filming this? Bro, you seen that drop? Yeah. It's right there. <laughs> Guys, you'll see how high we are when we look at from up the top. 
because literally the Dover port is right down there. I'm not even exaggerating. It's around about 300 feet drop just off of literally here. You can see there, if you've ever come into Dover, that's the crossing bit as you come in from the ferries, right there. You ready bro? Put your razor wire and all like there's barbed wire, there's razor wire. They don't want us to get in here dude. Ah oh, what are we doing? I'm gonna film you getting up here man, I'm gonna put the camera away. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do it with one hand. Oh shoot! Mate, I'm sliding. Oh, it's just so slippery in the wind. Oh shit! I'm already going. See if you can get to that. I'm hooked. I'm not hooked. I'm hooked. I'm sliding. Sliding everywhere, bruv. See me on there? <laughs> yeah. I think the barbed wire's got me. Let me hold back on again, though. Oh. Hey. Get to that fence to the side, Dave. Oh, wait. Over there. Dude, I think we're absolute morons. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen what's behind you? We've got a gap yet. Yeah. I'm trying not to look. Alright, I'll let you go again. And I'll, uh... Ah, oh, the barbed wire, mate. It's caught my back. What's all that razor next to you, dude? <sighs> That's what I mean. We've only got a couple of feet. Yeah, this Are you alright? Guys, this isn't this isn't just for views. This is literally pure. Like it is dangerous. If he slips, he'll probably knock me straight down as well. <sighs> you know, this is a place we wanted to get to. We wanted to see this place. <sighs> and it's not that. It's just the history of it as well. That the fact the soldiers, you know, defence system for Dover Castle, and. Uh, we're hoping to find some stuff maybe, some memorabilia from the old, oh my bag's stuck on everything. Oh, oh, mate, I'm sliding everywhere. Hey, you got the way out there. Oh, I'm gonna have to put a camera away, I think. Guys, girls, we just got up there. Oh. It's just so slippery. Oh, fuck. So the castle is up there still. Hey, bro. Yeah, be careful. You slide off, dude. That slide straight down. Oh, could that wind? Oh, it's that bad, guys. Tonight they've shut all the ferries and they've shut the Euro Tunnel. I'm not sure why the Euro Tunnel's closed, but. It's just so windy. Oh. <sighs> Guys, that's that. I'm going to swear nearly. That's that bloody high we've just climbed. There's the Dover Dock. Man, what the fuck, bro? Oh. 
<sighs> so guys, we're currently standing in a gun emplacement right here. And as March just spotted out, there's an old cannon upside down in the ground. Obviously from the Napoleonic, they probably reused it World War I and World War II as the placement to put a gun on. <sighs> Hopefully it's all worth this. These are, uh, what are they called? I can't remember. Oh, they're storing ammunition. Yeah, animation storage. We'll have a look at them on the way out. Bro, what are we doing? I'm not that big in a minute, I've got through that. Guys, I don't want to be too big headed, but we've survived. Storm, what should we call that? Bob. Storm Bob. We've got through it. I'm standing on the loop. I don't want for it to make too much noise, but we are literally in. And any minute when we get around the corner, I think we've looked at the plans of the tunnel one. walking on a defence drawbridge. So explain bro, how did this work? So I'm an enemy, I'm coming in. So imagine you pull it up and you'll fall down a ditch. <laughs> well behind that wall there, as you just pointed out. So explain to how it works bro. Okay. Right, so me and Mark are going to be a soldier each here. And we're going to pull it up over this pulley system up here, pulling it down. Oh! 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 And then wrap it up. Deep in the grass. Wow. That just shows you now how deep that pit is. The soldiers literally go in. There's the old weight there as well, look bro. Yeah. That's still gone. Oh mate, how clean this is. Guys. Alright, anyway, look how clean these rooms are. What is that do you reckon? If you pick that up, I'll give you a thousand pound right now, transfer it to your account. If you get it off the ground. <laughs> I don't even try and put it on. This is your legs, not your back. <laughs> Bro, you ain't getting a thousand pound. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Guys, if you know what that is, put in the links below, let us know. What, what was this contraption used for? But it weighs, that's probably half a tonne there, oh. you're trying to lift. Is there any writing on it? No, I'll just buy the big sack. Yeah, mate, let's look at that one. There's a light as well. Oof. Try and just give it a lift. Oh, I'm not going to lift it, man, my back. Yeah, That's what I didn't want to try. <laughs> Seeing you struggle with it. Yeah, do you know what? When I was little, we used to do the little tunnels near my house, and they always said these black butterflies meant a presence of death. And now you're going to laugh at me, you the guys watching us, but it's true. I just want to point out as well, Mark, these door frames are like 160 year old, bro. Yeah. Well, these a lot of these places, I mean, the castle dates about 100 years, but obviously a lot of these tunnel systems, well, then they would have been built probably under the castle later on, I'm not sure, but this wood, easy, a couple of 100 year old, and it's still solid. So out here, we've got to keep the light pretty much low, because this, I'm going to turn it off for a minute. But we're literally standing in the moat of the castle. It's pissing hard. But this is the old, again, a drawbridge system where we come up onto this door and lock this passageway. I just love seeing all the old bits there. And you can see the old weight system would have been here again, the wrapping ropes. I have to wipe my lens as well, I've got water all over it. Look at this. The old window frame still up there. You can see the wood around it as well and it's completely like rotted out of the bottom. And here, the window frames. I won't touch it in case it falls off. But obviously it probably would have been later on. Because you think, as I said, putting your guns through, but later on they would probably have panes of glass just to shut them up and stop that wind coming in. Heap soldiers car. I mean, it's fairly warm in here to be honest for a November, but... 
so clean, isn't it? The old power cut uh, bars along the top. You can hear the rumble, can't you? Loving all this old wood. So there ain't no like little makers carvings or you know what that is there, it's like an old stamp. I can't even see it, but it's like a little stamp in the woods. I'm literally just gonna say we can't get any further, but Mark's just seen this. Uh, someone has stacked bits of wood in front of the hole. Is it safe, bro? Um. What's that noise? Did you just make like a room noise? Mate, I feel like we're literally going to get in trouble for this. We get caught in here, man. It's all your idea. Deal? I don't think it matters. We'll still be going. Have to. up in prison. What'd you say? Probably end up in jail. And this will be us. See, keep pushing. I can see the head. <laughs> it's a boy. Mummy. Right now, hey. couple of rows in here. You see this? If it ever goes out of focus, just touch that very lightly. But it's in anyway. Hey, look at this Victoria Royal, I'm guessing. DL. And then down here, WD 40 War Department. Oh, they've put the M upside down. It's Mark and Dave. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and the arrow right there. Yeah, it's cool. Load it in the car, mate. You're up here to carry that back down the cliff. Come on, look. <laughs> Spider exact. Everywhere. <laughs> Is that you getting nervous? Squeaky floorboard. Dude, what I'm thinking of. When was the last time this fire was poked? When was it burning last? When was that chimney last used? Probably decades. Can you imagine the soldiers sitting down here having a laugh, all just chilling out? Obviously, I know it's scary. I know if it would have been, well, yeah. I don't think about the good times and all when they were together and they were their brothers, you know, make friends, just as me and you made friends in school. I'm sorry, I'm going to cut and edit the video. <laughs> Pile of rust. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Mate, look at it. This cupboard was up like that one. Yeah, it's you just see the original one. The old screw I was there for it. You think, if we probably come back in the next 10 years, I don't reckon I'll get up that hill, mate, in another 10 years, but... Yeah, in another 10 years, you'll right. find it. Yeah. This 
is where we arrived pretty much at Dover Castle. So obviously we've gone off the route now, but we're parked somewhere here and we've had to work. Let's start that again. We've parked somewhere basically down around here and we've worked all the way up pretty much all through the woods and we're currently under the castle somewhere. That's where we lost GPS outside. Then we went through and we've walked all them passageways through that open metal mm -hmm. door and now we're under the castle somewhere. That's pretty good. Hmm. And as I said, bro, we get caught. It's your head. Yeah, we're not, not good, is it? <laughs> door frame. It's crazy. You ready for the stairs? Are you going? ready for the stairs? What did you do to come in? We got our mic. We got our mic. You already got our mic? Yeah. Yeah, I'll do a bit here and then you can do a bit. <laughs> so, what do you think of Mark as the old cameraman? Who thinks he should get a camera and start filming his episodes? They all switches, yeah. Wait, does that flick up? It does move a bit. What do you reckon? <laughs> I'm not sure. Is it over castle? Is it still under the wall? Is it a national heritage? Is it a heritage site now? I think it all falls in that archive. Look at that. Some original writing here, dude. Was that 13 long? Four hangs, is that? You can work that out. I mean, Mark just noticed here. Cheeky. Bro, that was your internet back then. <laughs> All the men probably come round here for a little, for a little uh, Tommy Tank, you call it, innit? The old light's still up there. And you think they probably would have had the old green lampshade on it, it was completely right off. That is mad. It's mad, isn't it? It's crazy, dude. So as we embark on our journey deeper under the Dover Castle, we take the surrounding steps with a door that literally could fall on my head. A whole cave in coming through the wall. Deeper down, bro. All the old brackets still on the walls. Oh, look at that. I. I. Uh, oh no, is that here? Todd. Ben Green Honors JK 1940. And there's a subscri uh, subscribing in the wall there as well. Do you think this video is going to end up on YouTube? These soldiers didn't even know what internet was, bro, back then. That's KA there. Oh, wow, there's another one here. Is it Beacon? 23rd of the 10th, 1941. That's crazy. Do you realize, bro, that's like 80, 80 years ago, last month? Pretty much. What's this? Keep ends of cabin table. Cable. Oh, cable, sorry. Give me a sec. The same sermon, eh? The 3rd of the 7th, 1940. 1971. Just don't want to touch the walls, as, you know, it takes. Take any bits off and destroy old so history that's lasted 80 years. You go that way first. Look at these passageways. Mate, that looks dodgy as hell, doesn't it? I know it's all carved out of chalk. You hear that oh, rumble? Yeah, look at this. I didn't see. Cap hole bits. HB, JJ. Oh, this is crazy, and you can see there, that's Salon. AM. Um... KD. I think his man, mate, are long gone. 
If they're not, they're 100, a lot of these. <laughs> that says brothers there, exactly what I was saying about there. WA brothers. This is what I was talking about. Obviously, the trouble is though, MS looks like a heart, AC. Everywhere we go. Oh no, bro. MS love AC. Yeah. It's a little heart, isn't it? That's probably his like wife or something, you know, like, I don't know. Mark Spencer loves Annabelle or something. Yeah, wherever we go, we can't get away from them, cocks. Dude, and nowadays, this is back then they were carving this into the walls, but <laughs> nowadays it's like spray painted everywhere. It's literally... Go on, touch the tip, don't. <laughs> <laughs> it's makes you wonder that they've probably carved it. One is down there on his own, this passageway. He's probably carved it up to see how many boys notice it. Yeah, that bro, is that 1921? Yeah, it's cool. Is that, is that Alan? Is that yeah, Alan there? Yeah. KB? 1940, is that one again or a seven? Yeah, probably 41 seven. actually, because 47 is after the world. I don't oh, know, it, it does, does look like 47. When did the first Second World War finish? Is it 48? I think, uh, no. 45, 46, I think. I can't even literally think, and I know this as well. Right, okay. I know we're going to get comments below. There's Chris Packets. I think it's 45, 46. I lead the way, bro, you lead. Ah, oh, Lou, there again. This is crazy. I wonder if they're for putting lanterns on or something like that. I reckon it is, yeah. Yeah, little bits here, like passageways up. Not so no good. Obviously, it's not the same kind of light, but. Didn't that camera set? So now, turn my camera light off. If you can see how that kind of looks, bro. Mm. Like an old candle in there or an old lantern. Mm. That's pretty cool. Soldiers all up top. Oh, man. Right. You see how dark these passageways are as well, bro. Mm. Bro, I still can't believe we went to Dover Castle as kids in a school trip and now we're literally underneath it. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter how much money you pay, you will not get a trip down there. Oh, look at that. One of the old light fixings. There's loads of screenshots, but we can't read them. Yeah, it's quite hard. And you see how old these are, they're little drawings as well. What, on this wall? Yeah, this side. I've seen it already. Yeah, <laughs> A little face. Who's the watcher? It's just, I can't get over it, bro. Like, the guy that's carved that is just literally long gone. Oh, Spent so days and hours down here. Too thankful that they fight this way. I can't oh, bro, it. this is part of the tunnel you see on the map. This is literally, would walk you straight out on the ground. Yeah. Up the top. We need to be careful, it lights low. We'll go up there anyway, just so we can see the staircase. <laughs> Again, there's another area where the lanterns would have been. You can see the old stairwell rail would have been on. You can see the outline of it all the way around. Oh, you can, I wish we had candles now, just to put in there. And then you can see later on they put the old power in. So I'm pretty certain I could be wrong. Obviously, it was explained that these were for pouring hot oil in. Obviously, to stop enemy coming up and down the stairs, the soldier would be behind there and pour it through. Obviously, someone's knocked a hole later on. Look, me and Mark are going to check it out in there in a minute. <sighs> Look at this structure, this staircase. Nowadays, they'd probably build a castle out of plastic. Oh, yes, be careful. So, yeah, finally at the top, the old metal rail there, but we need to be quiet here. Mark's literally got to the top. I don't think I'm 
I show my light too much, but there's a fence just there. So when you pay to do public tours in this place, you'd walk right near that fence, look down at here, and they would explain probably the old, the old tunnels, the fence system. But you can't come down here, as I said, it doesn't matter how much you pay. I just still can't get over it around the castle. Looking back here. Let's hope no one that bro. Let's have a little look in that broken bit in the wall. And then we'll uh, we'll head back down and have a pass it. Oh don't. Oh yeah, that's it. Through there, bro. We're for pouring hot oil straight in as a defence system. Obviously someone smashed through the wall at some point thinking it's obviously another passageway off. Still. So what, just pour it all through here then? There's uh -huh. some spiders there. Yeah, I just right, right near your head. <laughs> oh shit, it's exactly. Oh my fucking god, not this shit again. Guys, these are called, I think these are like tunnel spiders, but they're eggs they're everywhere. This is a raptophobia nightmare, right? Well, I'm not keen on it. This is where you stand there, there's one right behind you. Look how thick and clever, well, quality this wood is. So, don't know how many times you come through here. There's KB, there's another there. Look how that is there. It's crazy, isn't it? Yeah. I know what you see as well, you know a lot of the trench art, Mark? What they do out the old bullet shells, bomb shells, have you seen it? It's loads in there, loads. Right, let's head through the other way now. We've just come up that way, it's so windy through here. I feel like a soldier now, marching through here, bro. I wonder if it's like a certain area of posts where the soldiers have to stand. Do you know what I wonder as well? What's that? Why are some of the tunnels brick and some of it's I know, it's like they chalked it out and then maybe felt that's a bit unstable that bit, so then we bricked it in. Yeah. I'll tell you what though, the engineering that went into these places... It's all above that ramp from the gun pool. Is it? Well, no. I don't know if it is. Yeah, it probably is. But you imagine like, how strong, you know, the buildings were built back in the day. Like. Yeah. They've survived wars, they've survived hurricanes, everything, they're still standing. I think it'll make no difference if you know who lets off the neck. <laughs> That's what I said, the engineering that went into them and all. Well, I mean, nowadays it's all computer jack. Like that. There's a wood still in the steps as well. The bottom one's falling out. But you can imagine it all swept in here, couldn't you? A full clean floors. The shiny varnish bits of wood. Yeah. Look at that wind. So we got over an hour drive home as well, and you can hear how bad it is. Not longer. I've got to drive back from Milton. What's that? <laughs> it's exploding rickets. She's falling. Oh, if you see the whole holiday camp, we found one of these. It's a life raft, isn't it? I think it might be. You know? Should we have a ride on it and go out to sea? Mark, look at that wind. Right, I'm going to turn my light off because you don't need a light here. But... Just proving. Maybe it's um the no. aphrodite. Oh, 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 oh! She's choking, Mark. Help her. <laughs> Foot and artery. I didn't know the soldiers had them back in the day. What confuses me is they're quite squishy. <laughs> you want to take that home, didn't you? No. Why has it got tits? Bro, it looks right, like a woman. Hey, 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 listen. 
it's leave got a mouth open, but then it's got... Take nothing, take leave footprints, bro. You can't take it. Just left footprints on a titty. Just don't get wild. <laughs> it's got a kick. Right, guys, there's an old video. It's like it's way back. We explored an old holiday camp that we actually went on holiday when we were kids um, up in Norfolk in the UK. <laughs> Made shoes fall to the brim. Right, anyway, <laughs> what I was going to say. Um, yeah, what was it? We did an old holiday camp, wasn't it? Uh, um, so it's when, yeah, Pontins. It's when we were kids, obviously, for the United States overseas viewers. Pontins is basically our holiday camp. It's a bit like, uh, yeah, it's a caravan park anyway, but trailer park, as the Americans call them, I believe. But yeah, we found one of those, but she was in bits, so we called her Exploding Rita, and uh, yeah, we just found Rita again. Are right, you ready? Let's get Keep ready. going, bro. Can't get over that wind, mate. I don't yeah, even want to go wrong. outside. Do you think that's got worse, that wind? I don't know, we're high up though, isn't we? But that took my breath away. Mate, I've got a fly in that wind. Is that really foggy? I'm not sure. Lights. Nice. Oh, there's another hole looking at that, mate. Oh! It's enough to your breath away, man. I think the foggy's the chalk we can see. Saying, well, this is what we had to climb to get into this because my sight and my eyes just. You right in there, bro? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's in there somewhere. But it does. I don't know what. I'm going to take my bag off and go through and see if we can find him. But I know it looks quite big and it crawls off left, right. <sighs> Let's go and do it. It feels like the catacombs again. Uh, to the fault, I shouldn't have through my head when I'm going through places like this. Uh, bits could collapse any time. When you're doing these old passageways, just the sound of your voice, the vibration. Ian Breed has some has added their own right in 1961. Why? Upsets me when people have literally done their own names right next to obviously old soldiers writing. Something old scraping there on the rocks. I'm not claustrophobic, but just the thought you're in here, you're chiseling away through these small passageways. There's a little bat there, I'm not going to disturb him. There's a little bat. Sleep there. Leave him be. because the ground feels quite hollow as well. Dude, where the, where the hell was you? Did you hear me going in through it? Magic. Yeah. You heard me go through it? I did call you, you didn't hear me? That's like proper dead sand through there. <laughs> Mate, that is a crawl. It, it done my back. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Oh, mate. Right, let's see what else we can find. Mate, I'm just excited to be underneath the castle. <laughs> just off tours. 
And this is truly what exploring. I know the houses are cool and I do love the houses, but I feel like this is pretty much what's, you know, helped Britain for a lot. It's becoming a forgotten Yeah, exactly. It is forgotten history. That was crazy, obviously. Now we've got to try and get back out and get down. We're going to, before we do, we're going to go and check out the uh, arms room, the ammunition rooms, and uh, see what else is up here. Yeah, it's crazy. Loving it. Loving it, loving it, loving it. Loving it like that. We're loving it, loving it, loving it. Mark, I feel like a prisoner. Don't leave me. Uh. <laughs> Explorers find a secret hole in the wall. So this is an old magazine. What did they use magazines for, Dan? Wankers. To store... Ammunition. Exactly. My little shelves, mate. I love things like this. Just seeing it there. The old slate. How's that beer can be in there? I don't know if I'd want to be back in the day, man, not here fighting and stuff. <sighs> Imagine being back in the day, though, man. Yep. Knowing that any minute you can get attacked. And obviously, World War II, and I believe they run like, a lot of power through these. And, um, yeah, again, these were. Use. I mean, this was a big point of attacking the UK through. Oh yeah, it the would be, innit? First place. Straight route. Through, innit? Attack Dover. Another magazine. I've seen the old pride flag up here as well. But there's nothing stopping a lot of people just getting to this bit. I mean, where we had to go to get right under the castle. It was so dangerous. And if anyone sees this video, please don't risk it. I mean, we haven't even got back down yet, but... I slip back down. I do love you, man. <laughs> You're going all the way, Dan. I feel like this is why you come out exploring. Like, she wants to see me go off. Because <laughs> <sighs> literally raised the wire and I drop, literally right behind me. My boots aren't even gripping anymore. I'm just going to jump for it, dude. Go on. <sighs> Got the right oh, fence. No. Got the fence. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse the language, but bro, you know how bad that is. Not too bad. <laughs> oh, oh, I lost my cab. Lost everything. Got me camo crocs on, so you can't see my feet. They're invisible. Coming for us. Who? Oh. Is that place? You hear it now. So, guys, we're literally going to end the video now. Thank you so so much for watching us both. Obviously, loved you all. Um, you can hear police sirens, we're a little bit uh, concerned at the minute, but yeah, yeah, we're in like a, it's like a private kind of road here, so. But it's yeah, 20 guys, past two in the morning. And 20, 20 past two? Yeah. Shut up, what do you mean? Yeah. I ain't getting home to that after you. <laughs> oh, I ain't you gonna get into that before. Oh, alright guys, love you loads, and thank you so, so much for supporting AWE, you know, every way you can, just by watching us. Uh, follow us on all social medias, all links below guys, Facebook, Instagram, you name it, we're on it. Um, but it's out for me guys out for Marky love you low stay safe and we'll see you on the next adventure